before I got in it. <laughs> yeah, keep singing. One more, singing. More, knees, kid. one more chorus. Oh, man, how do they expect us to live without any running water? Oh, we got running water. We just got to run a mile and a half to get it. <laughs> oh, come on, Fooch. What's with the shower? Give. Sorry, really, son. Your water ration all used up for today. Man, no water, no heat, no electricity. Man, are we living. Come on, come on, you wait, boss. Stop your griping. What's the matter with you? Who's griping, Skip? We're just counting our blessings. Ah, uh, you prima donnas are getting soft. It won't hurt you to rough it a little bit. Skip! Skip, I just ran into some GIs down the road. The quartermaster's setting up a shower unit in Cabo Velada. With lots of hot water? Well, what are we waiting for? <laughs> hold it, hold it, forget it. Cabo Velado is 20 miles away. And in case you jaybirds have forgotten, Captain Binghamton has us restricted to the base. Remember? Ah, oh, come on, Skip. Nobody's going a wall for a shower. Now that's it. Morning, matey. <laughs> hey, yeah. Uh... Now, how about that? You don't hear Mr. Parker griping, do you? If it's good enough for him, it ought to be good enough for you guys. Yeah. All right, Scrooge. Uh, okay, Pooch, let's go. Got to get scrubbed up for the war, you know. Fire when ready, Samurai. <laughs> hey, Fuji. No water. Tank must be stopped up. Must have been made in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you guys tell me I was standing in the wrong spot? Doesn't count. <laughs> but, General, Colonel Harrigan must have misrepresented my position to you, sir. I never complained about my quarters, General. I, I, I may have mentioned the plumbing a little bit, but I, I'm, a, I'm a rugged fighting man, and as such, a, I like to rough it, General. I mean, the rougher, the better. Sir, your bubble bath is ready. <laughs> yeah, excuse me, General. Uh, my exec just rushed in with an urgent bubble uh, uh, bullet. Yes, I, I know Colonel Harrigan is in charge of military government here, General, and I'll, I'll cooperate with him in every way possible, General. All right, thank you, sir. Thank you, yes. Over and out. <laughs> Bye, General. <laughs> oh, that rat Harrigan. Can you imagine him misrepresenting my position to that General? He's just trying to get me in trouble with the General, that's all. The man is anti-Navy, that's what he is. Oh, sir, sir, he's got you all unnerved. But a good soak in this tub will ease those tensions. I've got the water all nice and heated. And, sir, I even put in some bubble bath. The nerve of those people. Expecting me to live in a drafty dump like this with a bombed-out bathroom. It's uncivilized. Sir, I, I don't mean to rush you, but Colonel Harrigan could walk in here at any moment, and we wouldn't want him to find out that we have this tub because don't we never did report it. Because we aren't going to use the tub. I'm, and why should I report it? All I did was liberate this tub so Harrigan couldn't get his clammy little hands on it. That's all. <laughs> he is the most miserable, conniving, under... Uh, what are you gawking at? Sir, do you always take a bath in your swim trunks? Well, of course I don't, know, you ninny. But until they put some shutters on these windows, you don't think I'm gonna prance around here like Lady Godiva, do you? Lady <laughs> Godiva. Get out of the way. Ooh! Where did you get this water? Too hot, sir? Never mind. Give me the soap. Ah, uh, Captain. Oh, I am. Uh, <laughs> for the life. Can a man have any privacy? Well, uh, I'm sorry, sir, but I'd never expect you to be taking a bath in your own office. Hey, a skate trope. Hey, hey boy, look at that. Hey, how fast will she go, sir? Stop it, stop it. Stop it. Mikhail, get that baboon out of here. Oh, we just came over to get your permission, sir, to go up to Copa Velada. You see, the quartermasters have rigged up a, a shower unit up there. That... Negative, Mikhail. Negative, negative, negative. Will you get that peeping Tom away from me? <laughs> yeah, that, sir, sir, look, we don't have any running water. We're a bivouac, and we, we are entitled to a decent shower, sir. You're breaking my heart, Mikhail. This is not a luxury cruise, you know. This is a war. We've all got to make some sacrifices. You don't see me complaining, do you? Now, Roy, more bubble bath. <laughs> Oh, come on, Captain. Oh, look, we, we could take a fast run up there and be back in two shakes. Yeah, boy, hey, I wish we could take some of this stuff. It really smells great. Stop feeling my bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> you miserable little fiend, you. Get him out of here. Get back to your base. You're all restricted. No, 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 no. Come on, Chuck. I hope you enjoy your bath, sir. Not me. Hope all your bubbles bust. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, boy, the guys are sure going to be disappointed. Oh, no, they're not. You're getting my clean floor all I'll the way. clean floor you, you baboon, no, you. No, no, oh, sir. Oh, sir. Oh, that's smart, sir. I, I can't see. Sir, a towel. Sir. Well, you stop sniveling and shut the door. I'm in a draft here. Sir, I can't see. Oh! Oh! oh. 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 Run away, bathtub! Lean, lean! Oh, tilt. Oh, I, I got Colonel Harrigan. Well, if it isn't Bubbles Binghamton. <laughs> Having your regular Saturday night dry grace? Now, now, Colonel, yeah, I can explain all this. You, you see? I tell you what I see. I see a naked captain. Now, get up out of there before I have it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it. <clears throat> we almost lost the PTA. Oh, you don't have to worry about anything, sir. He's got his bathing trunks on. Well, I should have expected that. I mean, any sane person would have sense enough to put something on. Before he went for a ride in his bathtub. <laughs> yeah, let me give you a hand there, Captain Bubble, sir. Get your hands off of me, Mikhail. And have your fingernails cut. <laughs> what are you people standing around gawking at? Don't you have anything to do? Cat, cat, cat. Get out of here. Cat, cat. Hold it, hold it. Been doing a little moonlight shopping, I see. Moonlight shopping? Oh, you mean the, the tub. I'm ashamed of you, Captain Binghamton. A man of your rank. Stooping to common thievery. Thievery? What thievery? I, I, I just, I, I rescued this tub from the rubble. I, I gave it a good home. For your info, Captain, all confiscated equipment automatically becomes the property of the U.S. Armed Forces. Sergeant, empty this tub out, put it in my car. I'm taking it in. Wait, this is mine. It's my tub. Look, get your pants on, Binghamton. You're due for a staff meeting at command headquarters in Marcina in half an hour. Hubba, hubba! I did. Now, tough luck, Captain, but it's like you've always said. All of us have to make a few sacrifices. Yeah, it's too bad you only have one bathtub to get to your country. <laughs> that does it, fat boy. This is gone. <laughs> is this half an often, Commander? Oh, no, no, sir. Just on bath nights. <laughs> Hope I haven't forgotten how to take one. I only get a chance to use a talk on part of that book he sent me. I hope you don't get in trouble, Skip, running out in Binghamton's orders like this. Oh, I'm just not going to let old Binghamton give us the shiv while he soaks his flab in a bubble bath. Uh-uh. All we got to worry about is getting back before he gets through with that staff meeting. Hey, Skip, look! It's a Jerry. He's coming in. Battle stations, boys, Move! Move! move. Well, what are you waiting for? An invitation? Shoot! Okay, you're asking for it, fella. Oh, you want to fight dirty, huh? Skip! Skip the fuel line got knocked out! Oh, for crying out loud. Listen, make a smoke screen. We'll try to hide under it. Go on, quick. I'll help you, Jay. Talk about just making it. Sure. We were sure lucky to shake that band. Yeah, but where the heck are we? Yeah, that Jerry chased us way off course. Hey, how are you guys? Okay? Yeah, yeah thanks. Take right, so. a how, how about that fuel line? How's it coming? Yeah, it's shot up pretty bad, Skip. I need an eight-inch piece of pipe to patch it up. Oh, isn't that just ducky? Boy, that'll look good in the log. <laughs> Something funny happened on the way to the showers. You gonna radio the base, Skip? Oh, sure, and let them know we're playing hooky. Now oh, we gotta scrounge up some pipe. Tell you what, Chuck, uh, Groover, Tink, you guys come with me. The rest of you guys stay right here and keep your eyes open. I got a hunch we're pretty close to the front lines. Come on. How do you like that for a snub, Carpenter? The general didn't pay any attention to me all during that staff conference. And then he invited everybody to stay for lunch except me. I tell you, it's un American. <laughs> Sir, it could be your dandruff. I've been meaning to speak to you about it. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Well, I've been meaning to. 
Farragut's car with my bathtub in it. It's your tub, all right, sir. That's your ring around it. I knew he wasn't going to turn that tub in. He's going to keep it for himself, that tub napper. Sir, what are you going to do? You're not going to steal it. No, I'm just going to pick it up and hit a smart lieutenant with it. That's oh, all. Oh, but... Babbling and help me with this thing. Oh, but, sir, I... Oh, you, you peasants there, don't stand around gawking. Come over here, give me a hand with this. Uh, halpa, halpa. <laughs> that's the nice But, thing. sir, what about Colonel Harrigan? Oh, that's sneak. I'll show him Bubbles Binghamton strikes back. All right, uh, heave the hull. Uh, heave the hull. Uh, heave the hull. That's a good boy. Over here, Colonel. Right. right in here. Heave the hull. Good boys. Oh, oh, oh. oh, pasta for everybody. Get Thank you, you. Thank you, you. That's fun. All right. That's good. That's lovely, lovely. Looks peaceful enough, but keep your eyes open. Hey, turn the attack. We're surrounded. Hit the deck. Hold it. It's only a cow. A cow? Are you sure? Where would an Italian cow learn how to speak American? Maybe she went to night school. Come on. C'è qualcuno qui? Oh, it's a good thing that Skip's mother was Italian. Shh. Hey, buddy. Let's take a look. Nobody in there. Whoever it was should took off in a hurry. I heard he must have left in the middle of lunch. Wait for that spaghetti. Watch it, boys. This whole place could be booby trapped. Hey, Yaku, Skip's right. Nothing messier than booby trapped spaghetti. <laughs> boys, there's only one reason why these poor farmers would leave in such a hurry. You mean Germans? You mean we're behind enemy lines? I mean, I think that's exactly where we are. All right, now, you guys, let's not panic. I mean, after all, we gotta get oriented. Now, the first thing you do when you're in a combat area is get the lay of the land. Then you watch out for enemy troop movements. Well, see, just like I told you, there they are, the Germans. I want you to spot the Germans! Holy jumping hand, it is a Jimmy Patrol. Come on, stand back from the window. All right, you guys, now cool keel. I mean, don't fire and see the whites of the race. Hold oh, it, hold it. No, 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 no. Those pea shooters are no good against the burp guns. Besides, they probably got a whole battalion following them. What are we going to do? Invite them in for pizza? <laughs> okay, so this is no time for jokes. Hey, wait a minute, Tink. That's a great idea. It is? Yes! Wait a minute. Look, get in these clothes quick. It's our only chance. Yeah, if not a dress. That's an order. Come on, move. Oh, come on, they'll be here any second. Hurry up, you guys. Yeah, yeah, Skip, I've seen Italian hairdo, but I'll never get away with this. Benvenuto. Come on, come on. Oh, it's a great honor for you nice soldier boy to come a bit to visit Angelo's house. Say it, Tom Cops. Uh, well, no, no, you got all the wrong. The name is Angelo, no dumb cop. Say it. Who else is it? So I would say it's just us poor contadine, farmers, you know. How did you find out so far? You see, is it? Oh, it's a nice, beautiful family. <laughs> it's my mama. <laughs> and it's my bambino, the baby, you know, Fiorello. <laughs> and this a pretty little goose. That's my beautiful daughter, Rose. <laughs> see? Hello, Fräulein. <laughs> Well, I know you boys know how to catch American soldier, so we know how to you up, eh, in the itch and the cray. Nein, my man. Huh? Well, you come again sometime where you can stay longer, yes? Nein. 
Be here. Serve the food. Oh, but this is no good. This is just a wartime of spaghetti. That's oh, right. She that's tasted it. just like a shoelace. Yeah, no shoelace and more like a shoe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's safe to eat here. Serve the food. Schnell, 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 schnell. Serve the food. Schnell, schnell, schnell. Andiamo, serve la. Porca la miseria. Porca la miseria. Serve the food. What? Rose, rose. Yes, Ush, that's good. That's good. Pass out a little bit, va? Wilhelm, that fat foul line looks good to you. Yeah, sehr gut. You've been in the front lines too long. <laughs> you like a sauce? Oh, yeah, right. Good, 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 yeah. Good, good. Yeah, Rosa, watch the panka hank now. <laughs> More sauce. <laughs> Can't be the way back to the base. We've been driving around in circles for an hour. Well, I'm just following your direction, sir. You said you knew the way back. Well, if you don't think this is the right way, why don't you speak up and just say so, you pea brain, you're a pea brain. Well, I tried to, sir, 20 minutes ago. Don't you remember? You said Shut up. those were your exact words. Stop laughing and drive, drive, drive. Not an auto club in sight. No wonder they're losing the war. <laughs> Oh, sir, sir, look, over there. It's a farmhouse. Oh, we're saved, sir. Now, well, let's get over there. And watch the bumps. You damage my tub and I'll have your head. Yes, sir. Come by, the man. Clear up the table over here. <laughs> and now you nice gentlemen to have a nice meal. Angelo knows that it's you anxious to get, get it back into the war, right? So now you go and don't you worry about the dish. <laughs> oh, please, I'm no that kind of Fraulein. <laughs> Come on. Hey, Rosa, what are you doing? Spain, I'll tell you what's on a soldier of the race. Rosa, behave yourself a mama with a spank. Per <laughs> piacere, Sergeant. You got to forgive her. Rosa, you see, she's a little punch ever since the cow kicking her head. <laughs> now, so, arrivederci, now, you come back at some other time, eh? No, if you don't leave yet, if you have more wine. Wine, wine, don't know, no, no. it's all gone, kaput, kaput. Rest is this. Das is grapes, uh, help yourself. <laughs> Man, we want wine. You, 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 come see her, from Yo, oh, yeah. Make her defeat. <laughs> you want me to make her with defeat? Uh, <clears throat> yeah, make her defeat. But uh, because to make her with defeat, to make her wine, it's going to take a longer time. Be wait. Make her defeat. Schnell, schnell, schnell. Faster, 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 faster. And you are a soldier stander. Make her some more to eat. Bring us some pizza. Pizza. Or pizza. Get back! I'm going to finish off at Himmel, what is los with the Badawala? Wilhelm, Hans, say sie raus! Excuse us, Sergeant, but what's going on? Well, don't move on. Sir, aren't you glad I brought along my Italian-English dictionary? Now, how do you say we are lost? Oh, <laughs> shut up. I'll do the talking here. Uh, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I want a haircut. Moron wrote a book like this, for heaven's sake. Well, sir, the first thing you say is buongiorno. That means good morning or good afternoon. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. I know what it means. I want a haircut. <laughs> Uh, born Giorno. Oh, blast this book. Why don't you people learn how to speak English like everybody else? Oh, 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 oh. I think we better know. We're coming up. We're going there. I can't remember my serial number. It begins with a six, maybe a five. Do you remember my oh, number? Shut up, shut up. I, I hope you fellas aren't going to do anything drastic. I mean, we wouldn't do anything to hurt you. As a matter of fact, I used to own a German Shepherd. Oh, he's a lovely animal, too. Right. I think I have a picture. Right. Sit, 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 sit. Huh? Sit down, Schweins. He doesn't like you. Herr Hauptmann, we have two American officers gefangen genommen. You peasants just gonna stand there and let them abuse us like this? Do something. We're friends of Joe DiMaggio. Oh, sir, sir, 
that peasant girl over there with the, the blue feet. We've seen her before. Oh, for our lives are hanging by a thread and you're ogling peasant girls with blue feet. Yeah, like... <clears throat> I don't believe it. Hey, watch, watch. And don't you put your hands on my daughter, you filthy Amerigan. He's not your daughter, and... And you're Angelo Boselli, you pig! I know talking to you, Yankee dog. <laughs> that little crackpot, you. <clears throat> I know have to take that, Papa. Why don't you take it? No, go, Rosa. Hey, you, Capitano, watch out. You Italianus, get over there. <clears throat> They're overcoming, Don Fonster, so you and the Lieutenant, march there. Hey, Sergeant, you wait for just a minute till we're going to make you a nice four pizzas to go. Hey, Mom, Rosa, Fiorella, Andiamo, four pizzas. You got to make a nice four pizza. <laughs> no, no, we cannot be. Oh, we, so we almost got it ready. Yeah, look. Hey, <laughs> bella, bella, <boy. laughs> Look at that, huh? Nice, nice. <laughs> All right, bambina. Here we go. Buona fortuna. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys, up with him. Up, up, up. Much now. All right, you're the skipper. Let's go. Rouse, rouse. It's this time, Fräulein. Ach, du Liebe. The Americanos don't fight fair. Oh, that's too bad. All right, come on, rouse. Out. <laughs> All right, Raquel, I'll take over now. They're my prisoners, and so are you. <laughs> We're your prisoners. Oh, come on, Captain. Have you flipped? I'll show you who's flipped when I file my charges with the commanding general. Going AWOL, taking a boat out against orders, being out of uniform. <laughs> <laughs> One court martial I wouldn't like to miss. Oh, but you're not going to miss it, Captain. <laughs> you see, you'll be right there trying to explain why you were joyriding behind the enemy lines uh, with a, uh, a stolen bathtub in your cheek. <laughs> Hey, Skip, look, this pipe is just what we need for that fuel line connection. You're kidding. Get your hands off of that pipe. You've damaged my tub and I'll have you shot. Calm down, Captain. A 73 needs that pipe worse than you do. All right, you Krauss. Let's grab hold of that bathtub and let's go back to the boat. Krauss, Krauss. We'll see you back in the town, Gabby Wait a minute. Wait a minute, you mechanic. Put that back. That tub belongs to me. Uh, don't feel too bad, Wally. You can put a star in your window. You got a bathtub in the service. I'll put you in my window, you dodo. <laughs> Easy. Can't hit a seniorina. Oh, I'll hit you. <laughs> Captain, Captain, I want to get this inside before that creep Harrigan keeps snooping around here. Would you get out of the... Captain. Oh, Colonel Harrigan. You were saying, Binghamton? Yeah, you were, I was, I was saying. Well, uh, the, the, the captain is much too modest to admit it, sir, but uh, you see, he saw this Jerry Patrol running off of the tub, and, uh, well, under his brilliant leadership, uh, uh, we went out and uh, tracked the enemy down and captured them, sir. And you captured an enemy patrol? Oh, well... Where are they? Yeah, well, well uh, good, good work, Michael. Good work. Where, where, uh, oh, we turned them over to G2. You know, it's all in a day's work. <laughs> G2, gentlemen. Eh? Well, I'd better get right over there. Now, you men load this tub in my car and handle it with care because G2's probably going to want to check it for fingerprints. Now, wait, wait a minute. That tub is mine and the picture belongs to spoil. Now, let's not be corny, Bingham. I'm not being corny. I'm not going to get back up. Let's not corny. Ah! Ah! But, General, Colonel Harrigan must have misrepresented my position to you, sir. I never complained about my quarters, General. I, I, I may have mentioned the plumbing a little bit, but I, I'm, a, I'm a rugged fighting man, and as such, a, I like to rough it, General. I mean, the rougher, the better. 
sir. Your bubble bath is ready. <laughs> yeah, excuse me, General. Uh, my exec just rushed in with an urgent bubble uh, uh, bullet. Yes, I, I know Colonel Harrigan is in charge of military government here, General, and I'll, I'll cooperate with him in every way possible, General. All right, thank you, sir. Thank you, yes. Over and out. <laughs> Bye, General. <laughs> oh, that rat Harrigan. Can you imagine him misrepresenting my position to that general? He's just trying to get me in trouble with the general, that's all. The man is anti-Navy, that's what he is. Oh, sir, sir, he's got you all unnerved. But a good soak in this tub will ease those tensions. I've got the water all nice and heated. And, sir, I even put in some bubble bath. The nerve of those people. Expecting me to live in a drafty dump like this with a bombed-out bathroom. It's uncivilized. Sir, I, I don't mean to rush you, but Colonel Harrigan could walk in here at any moment and we wouldn't want him to find out that we have this tub because don't we never did report it. Because we aren't going to use the tub. I'm, and why should I report it? All I did was liberate this tub so Harrigan couldn't get his clammy little hands on it. That's all. <laughs> he is the most miserable, conniving, under... Uh, what are you gawking at? Sir, do you always take a bath in your swim trunks? Well, of course I don't, know, you ninny. But until they put some shutters on these windows, you don't think I'm gonna prance around here like Lady Godiva, do you? <laughs> Lady Godiva. Get out of the way. Ooh, where did you get this water? Too hot, sir? Never mind. Give me the soap. Ah, uh, Captain. Oh, I... Uh, <laughs> Up for the luck, Captain. Oh, I got Colonel Harrigan. <laughs> Well, if it isn't Bubbles Binghamton. <laughs> Having your regular Saturday night dry grace? Now, now, Colonel, yeah, I can explain all this. You, you see? I tell you what I see. I see a naked captain. Now, get up out of there before I have it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it. <clears throat> we almost lost the PTA. Oh, you don't have to worry about anything, sir. He's got his bathing trunks on. Well, I should have expected that. I mean, any sane person would have sense enough to put something on before he went for a ride in his bathtub. Yeah, let me give you a hand there, Captain Bubbles, sir. Get your hands off of me, Mikhail. And have your fingernails cut. What are you people standing around gawking at? Don't you have anything to do? Cat, cat, cat. Get out of here. Cat, cat. All that, all that. Been doing a little moonlight shopping, I see. Moonlight shopping? Oh, you mean the tub. I'm ashamed of you, Captain Binghamton. A man of your rank. Stooping to common thievery. Thievery? What thievery? I, I, I just, I, I rescued this tub from the rubble. I, I gave it a good home. For your info, Captain, all confiscated equipment automatically becomes the property of the U.S. Armed Forces. Sergeant, empty this tub out, put it in my car. Oh, wait, I'm wait. taking it in. Wait, this is mine. It's my tub. Look, get your pants on, Binghamton. You're due for a staff meeting at command headquarters in Marcina in half an hour. Hubba, hubba! I did. Uh, it's tough luck, Captain, but it's like you've always said. All of us have to make a few sacrifices. Yeah, it's too bad you only have one bathtub to get me country. <laughs> that does it, fat boy. This is gone. Oh. Does this happen often, Commander? Oh, no, no, sir. Just on bath nights. <laughs> I got in it. Keep singing. One more chorus. Oh, man, how do they expect us to live without any running water? Oh, we got running water. We just got to run a mile and a half to get it. <laughs> oh, come on, Boots. What's with the shower? Give. Sorry, really, son. Your water ration all used up for today. Man, no water, no heat, no electricity. Man, are we living. Come on, come on, you wait, boss. Stop your griping. What's the matter with you? What's the matter, Skip? We're just counting our blessings. Ah, uh, you prima donnas are getting soft. It won't hurt you to rough it a little bit. Skip! Skip, I just ran into some key highs down the road. The quartermaster's setting up a shower unit in Cabo Velada. With lots of hot water? What are we waiting for? <laughs> hold it, hold it, forget it. Cabo Velado is 20 miles away. And in case you jaybirds have forgotten, Captain Binghamton has us restricted to the base. Remember? Ah, oh, come on, Skip. Nobody's going a wall for a shower. Now that's it. Morning, mateys. <laughs> there you are. Now, how about that? You don't hear Mr. Parker griping, do you? If it's good enough for him, it ought to be good enough for you guys. Yeah. All right, Skip. Bye. Okay, Pooch, let's go. Gotta get scrubbed up for the war, you know. Fire when ready, samurai. Hey, Fuji, no water. Tank must be stopped up. Must have been made in Japan. <laughs> Why did you guys tell me I was standing in the wrong spot? 
Doesn't count. Can a man have any privacy? Well, I'm sorry, sir, but I'd never expect you to be taking a bath in your own office. Hey, a skate trough. Hey, hey boy, look at that. Hey, how fast will she go, sir? Stop it, stop it. Stop it. Mikhail. Get that baboon out of here. Oh, we just came over to get your permission, sir, to go up to Copa Volata. You see, the quartermasters have rigged up a, a shower unit up there that... Negative, Mikhail. Negative, negative, negative. Will you get that peeping Tom away from me? <laughs> yeah, that, sir, sir, look, we don't have any running water. We're a bivouac, and we, we are entitled to a decent shower, sir. You're breaking my heart, Mikhail. This is not a luxury cruise, you know. This is a war. We've all got to make some sacrifices. <laughs> You don't see me complaining, do you? Now, Roy, more bubble bath. <laughs> oh, come on, Captain. Oh, look, we could take a fast run up there and be back in two shakes. Yeah, boy, hey, I wish we could take some of this stuff. It really smells great. Stop feeling my bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> you miserable little fiend, you. Get him out of here. Get back to your base. You're all restricted. No, 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 no. Come no, on, no. Chuck. I hope you enjoy your bath, sir. Not me. Hope all your bubbles bust. <laughs> now, oh. oh boy, the guys are sure gonna be disappointed. Oh no, they're not. You're getting my clean floor all right. Clean floor, you, you baboon! No, you. No, no, oh, sir, oh sir, oh that's smart, sir. I, I can't see, sir, a towel, sir. Oh, yeah, stop sniveling and shut the door. I'm in a draft here. Yeah. Sir, I can't see. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Hope I haven't forgotten how to take one. I don't get a chance to use a talk on part of that book he sent me. I hope you don't get in trouble, Skip, running out in Binghamton's orders like this. Oh, I'm just not gonna let old Binghamton give us the shiv while he soaks his flab in a bubble bath. Uh-uh. All we gotta worry about is getting back before he gets through with that staff meeting. Hey, Skip, look! It's a Jerry. He's coming in. Battle stations, boys, move! Move! move. Well, what are you waiting for? An invitation? Shoot! Okay, you're asking for it, fella. Oh, you want to fight dirty, huh? Skip! Skip the fuel line got knocked out! Oh, for crying out loud. Listen, make a smoke screen. We'll try to hide under it. Go on, quick. I'll help you, Talk about just making it. Oh, sure. We were sure lucky to shake that band. Yeah, but where the heck are we? Yeah, that Jerry chased us way off course. Hey, how are you guys, okay? Yeah, yeah thanks. Take a how, how about that fuel line? How's it coming? Yeah, it's shot up pretty bad, Skip. I need an eight-inch piece of pipe to patch it up. Oh, isn't that just ducky? Boy, that'll look good in the log. <laughs> Something funny happened on the way to the showers. You gonna radio the base, Skip? Oh, sure, and let them know we're playing hooky. <laughs> <laughs>